I'm in the mood for a little bit of Mexican food today. Okay, don't get all excited. I, I'm not trying to be disrespectful to anybody. I like my food the way I cook my food. A couple days ago when I did my uh, spaghetti video, I had some guy claiming to be Italian. I don't know if he is or isn't. Um, it was, didn't like the way it looked and told me it was not going to taste very good. You make your food how you like to make your food. I'll make mine how I like to make mine. So is this traditional Mexican food? No. It's quick. It's easy. It's something I like. So what I have done is in this pan, some refried beans and some uh, the canned chicken from Sam's Club. Love this stuff. Canned chicken from Sam's Club. It's chicken breast in water with a little bit of salt. Rinse it out um, with some hot water. Uh, before you start using it, that's what I do. It makes it taste a little bit better. So refried beans and that chicken heated up in the pan. I had pre-cooked rice. I like uh, brown rice. I pre-cooked that. I use a rice steamer. Um, these are for these. Uh, what, I guess it's just a rice cooker. Black and Decker makes these. Um, it's fantastic. You just stick it in there, hit the hit the go button, and it's, it's done when it's done. So put a little bit of rice down on this pan. First, it, this is a um, broiler safe pan. You'll see why it's broiler safe in a second. But I put some rice down like that. Um, these are whole wheat tortillas. I'm gonna take half and half, or half of the uh, the refry, put it on one. There's two of them here. It might have been difficult to see it um, layered like that, but. And then just roll it up like that. And again, this is, this is how I make them. This is not necessarily <laughs> traditional at all. Um, if you're a traditional uh, Mexican food kind of person, you know, you're probably cringy right now. But anyways, like I said, this is how I like to do stuff. It's fast, it's easy. It's how I do it. So I put those on there like that. Shake a little bit of cheese on top. I also have the broiler in my oven going now, uh, high broil. That's why this is all going on a heat resistant plate. The cheese is not cooperating with me. There we go. A little bit of cheese on the top. So this is going to go under the broiler for a couple of seconds. Basically just enough to melt the cheese. We have our lettuce and our salad spinner. Um, if you watched my um, spinach salad video, you know that I've already washed this in lemon juice, spun it out. We're good to go there. And you see, this this is a couple days old lettuce. It's not brown or anything. So that the lemon juice really does work for that stuff. All right, these should be melted. And it is nicely melted. That's why we got the heat resistant plate. This set came with these little wooden things so you can carry it over the table. I like, we got some roasted green chilies that I'm gonna put on one of these. So I put that on one. And then just regular chunky salsa, which I also like. I'm gonna put on the other. So a little red, a little green. And then lettuce, I'm a big fan of lettuce. Put some lettuce on top. And then also, a couple little things of sour cream. And that, careful the plate's hot, is how I do my Mexican food. 